Tonight, a mother is grieving the loss of her son hit and killed on I-29. Good evening, I am Bria Berry. Police say the semi driver who hit Alex Robinson didn't stop, and now they hope someone with information will come forward. KNBC 9's Brian Johnson is live at North Kansas City Hospital with how Alex's memory will live on. Brian. Yeah, Bria, well, the family thought they were hoping that Alex might recover, but tonight they say that is not going to happen, but they do take peace in knowing that his organ donations will help eight others live on. 16 year old Alexander Robinson wanted to be an aviation mechanic. He's working at Culver's and planning to graduate from Park Hill next year. His mom says Alex was outgoing and had tons of energy. The amount of visitors he's had has been overwhelming. Like it's been over 150 people have come up here. He's left such an impression. He impacted so many lives in 16 years. She says the two left the city for a better life and that Alex was growing into an incredible man. Teachers have called in tears. Can't even, you know, speak because they're so sad about his passing. And I'm just like, wow. And I all say the same thing. He was such a bright light. She says Alex was hit Wednesday night around 9:30 on I-29 southbound at Northwest 72nd Street. She believes Alex was crossing the interstate to head to a friend's house and says the semi that struck him never stopped. I'm mad. I'm sad. I'm angry. I'm hurt. I'm disappointed and I'm just trying to figure out, you know, how to move forward each day. She hasn't left the hospital since Wednesday. She doesn't think she'll be able to return home. She got the house for Alex. He made the environment great, as they would say. It's his energy. He was a positive kid. Live, laugh, love. So if you don't take anything from that, live, laugh, love. Because that's all you can do in this world. In North Kansas City, Brian Johnson, KMBC 9 News. Such a heartbreaking story. Now, the family has a mill train for donations to pay for medical bills. We have a link at KMBC.com if you'd like to help.